The Ark of Winnebago Boone in Ogle County serves people with intellectual and developmental disabilities. Joining us with more on what they do is Executive Director Amy Newell. Thanks so much for being with us this well, afternoon. Thank you for having me. It's so much fun to talk about the chocolate stuff, but before we get to that, let's talk a little bit about what the Ark does and what its mission is all about. So the Ark of Winnebago Boone in Ogle County is a local not-for-profit that works with individuals with intellectual and developmental disabilities through advocacy and support. So it can be Mean lots of different things and everybody's a little different. Um, typically it starts with a phone call to us with I have a child or I have an adult with a diagnosis of an intellectual or developmental disability. I'm not sure what to do. And so we help them. We help guide them. We may not be the answer for them, but we can always get them connected to the people that they need. It's really critical in our mind that we have those warm handoffs for people. But you know, we offer um, home-based services through the Medicaid home-based waiver, guardianship assistance, rep payee services. We have a huge art program that is just wonderful. And then uh, of course we have life skills classes and then lots of other trainings that we just offer at no and low cost to families because we feel that if we have the information, everybody else should have that information to help their person in their life live that full and inclusive lifestyle that works for them. Is one of the goals to let people kind of live as independently as possible? Yes, we, we want people with disabilities to live the life in the community of their choosing. We often say, you know, we don't, as people without disabilities, we like to be able to choose where we eat, where we go to church, all of those things. And we want people with disabilities to feel that same independence and that empowerment to do whatever they want, wherever they want. And the services that the ARC provides are offered, as you mentioned, at a low or no cost to the people. So the money's got to come from somewhere, right? <laughs> the money has to come from somewhere. And, you know, we do a lot of grant writing, but our fundraiser, the Chocolate Frolic, is really our big fundraiser. I think anytime you mention chocolate, people get pretty excited. <laughs> Well, and you know, we're really excited this year because it's on Leap Day. So we feel that that probably means that none of the calories No calories, count. of course. <laughs> Everyone knows that. We're seeing some video from some of your previous events. How many years have you been holding this now? This will be our 17th. Wow. And it is a big popular event. It is. And during COVID, we did have to shift and uh, we went to a to-go only box mm -hmm. for a couple years. And then in 2023, we opened up a VIP option for a, a group of people to come and um, have a couple hours of heavy appetizers, some entertainment, and then leave with their to-go box. Um, and we're going to do the same this year. We're really excited about our entertainment this year. It's going to be a local group called Mixtape. Hmm. It's a three-piece acoustical group. Um, but again, everything benefits the ARC and um, you'll still get those amazing chocolates in the box. We noticed that people really appreciated the to-go boxes because then they could sample all 20 items. Right, because I've been at the event previously <laughs> and you get full because there's so much to choose from. Right, because then you have to pick and choose. Right. When, it, when you're in person and there's 20 or 35 um, providers, you really have to go, well, which ones am I going to choose? With the box going home, you get to have all of them if you'd like. That's a great <laughs> benefit. Okay, so this year, the event, if they want to attend in person, is at the Tabala with entertainment, and you said an yep. appetizer. So that's the VIP option. So for a $50 donation to the ARC, you could get a to-go box, mm -hmm. and the pickup for that is between 11 and 5.30, and then we have a VIP in person for a $100 donation that um, then gets you your to-go box when you leave, but you get to have heavy appetizers from Perfectly Seasoned, of course, a sweets table on site, because you can't have an event, a chocolate frolic without some sweets there, but then your entertainment and we'll have some special silent auction items just for the in-person. We'll have an online silent auction that'll go live mid-February, but at the event we kind of keep a couple of the um, higher price items or things that might be harder to ship if we need to ship them sure. um, for the in-person event. And where can people get tickets? So um, chalkfrock.com, C-H-O-C-F-R-O-C.com. They can call our office, which is 815-965-3455, or they can come see us at 2820 McFarland Road. We share a space with the Boy Scouts. Terrific. All right, Amy, thanks so much for being with us. And everyone, I'm sure, is going to look forward to the Chocoholic Frolic. Thank Thank you.